you hip hop. I really don't know where you at, but please come back quick. I'm really sick and tired. People talking about money stacks. I'm sick and tired. People talking about the women they've got. That junk is old, making me want to vomit when I hear raps. Coming across like that, I know it's time for Christ to come back. Bring in the new bit of pad, the true MCs who love the art. Never de depart from the art like we don't depart from Christ. Biblical morals moving their torso, spit their best ass night. Yo, what's good, YouTube? Avenger Bassi here. Um, doing another Marvel Legends toy review on Marvel Legends Icons Venom. This thing is sick. Now, I know you, you can't see him because he's way, 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 way too tall. This guy's like 13 or 14 inches. You see, I have him holding Spider Man like I did in my ACBA shot thing. This thing is really nice. Um. My girlfriend got this for me for, I told you guys this in the Canada video, um, she, uh, she got, she got me this for taking her to Canada and New Jersey, cause I really, really did spend a lot of money in Canada and New Jersey and, um, so to say thank you, she got this and the big time Spidey and this thing, I am super impressed with, this is now one of my favorite Marvel Legends of all time, just by Toy Biz and Hasbro. So um, this guy's in it. Let's get to the review. Let's get rid of this Spider-Man real quick. Um, you can obviously see this is not my usual poster board. This is a this is cardboard because this guy's so big. I had to get it out. Um, let's start off with the face. You can see Eddie Brock right there. You see the yellow in his teeth. His face is so menacing. You can, you can get a uh, a look of how the symbiote is in his body. You could see like where his eyes would be. You can see the white right there, and the white where his eyes coming over here. Very nice. You can see a wart right there. I don't know if that's a wart. Oh, that's just a paint blemish. Oh, never mind. And his tongue is really nice too. It has a bendy wire in it. Now, there is a variant to this guy where his face is all covered, which I did see at that comic book store in New Jersey. Um, it was 60 bucks, and it goes for 60 bucks on line two. So I'm, I'm glad that she got me this one because that one is way, way too much. But uh, it has a bendy wire. And the reason why I mentioned that is because the one on this one is really small, and the other one is. A bigger tongue. Don't make a dirty joke about that, please. Um, so you can see right there, it's not really bendy. It's a little bendy, but it's not really bendy. You can see the Venom insignia. It has some blue shading on it, and it has some gray in it. The lines are really crispy. You see his six pack right there. This guy's ripped, man. Oh, power's almost out. Um, now I do have a few gripes with this guy. Uh, let me just give me a second. You can see this guy's knocking the camera over. That's just how big he is. And the rest of the figure is just black, and I don't mind it being black. It does have some blue shading in it. You can see right there. It's very hard to to see on the camera. So you guys really know I have a crappy camera and I want to get a new one. Um, so my two grabs with the figure. One, he has no... He doesn't have his webbing signal right there where he shoots his webbing. So that sucks. It's, it's supposed to be white. It's not there. And uh, what was the other thing? I think that was the only one. Oh. He's not wide enough. He's really, really big and he's really, really muscular. But he's not wide enough. What, what do I mean by that? Well, um, take myself. I have a lot of muscles on my body. Not like, like professional WWE wrestlers, but I have muscle on my body. And I am pretty strong. Um, but I'm not wide. And same thing with this guy. He's really, 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 really yoked. You can see all the muscles and everything, but he is not wide enough. So I bring out Thor. You can see how wide he is compared to this. You see what I'm saying? 
Um, yeah. Oh, and this guy has veins everywhere around his body, just to show how strong he is. Man, let me get my light out. There we go. You can see the blue shading now. Yeah. So, for the articulation, this is going to be really, really hard to do. So, for the, uh, for the non-variant, the head, the the jaw can move up and down but not on this one uh the tongue can move 360 head moves up down side to side and shifts a little bit oh, this is gonna be hard the arm moves forward and back and up and down bicep swivel double jointed elbows but it's a little bit hindered so um single jointed elbow would have been great uh, wrist swivel and the wrist goes up and down individual finger articulation which is amazing uh, he has an ab crunch waist swiv swivel uh, now um, he has a t-joint believe it or not so um, and I can't get this one to move maybe on this one alright it goes out and forward like that, thigh swivel, double jointed knees, cast swivel, ankle pivot, real nice ankle pivot on this guy. And the toe moves up and it doesn't move down. And I would love for it to move more down than this so I can get him in like um, a pose hanging on the ceiling. Actually, that might not be a good idea because this guy's really heavy. Um, he does come with a art book. Now, um, I told you guys many times I'm in college and one of the things I'm studying is art. I really, really love art. That's why I do ACBA. So, um, it's just his bio and everything. Just look at this art in the sky. He did a fabulous job on this. McFarlane style art. This one's my favorite. You see, this guy, he's wider on this, but on the figure, he's more thinner. Oh, that's pretty nice. I don't really like that one. This one, I don't really like either. Uh, this one's good. Just look how that, how big his tongue is, man. Damn. I'm chasing Spider-Man. Him versus Wolverine, you know, I already know who's gonna win. I love this one. And this one, I have this comic. Uh, it's over there, I don't want to get it. Uh, the Venom and Car Carnage storyline. I love that story by Clay Clayton where Toxin is born. FF and Venom and Spider-Man. And uh, I forgot this guy's name. His name is Thomas something. He's a different kind of Venom. And uh, that's it. I took the figure down. So, uh, yeah. Oh, and really quickly, um... How my videos are gonna go, basically this is how it's gonna go. Um, I'm gonna do a video every Tuesday, um, every Friday, and every Saturday. Possibly on Sunday, I'm not sure yet. But uh, that's my video plans because I feel like I don't post enough videos for you guys. All right guys, Avenger Vassy here. I know I'm kinda talking a little bit too much. And uh, yeah, all right, catch you later guys.